Well, there'll be no breaking that record round here because these two are only six weeks old. Oh, and by the way, no badgering me about a forecast. Badgery. Badger. Get it? It's the Tonight programme here at 7.30 this evening. Now, though, it's time for our... Ah! Moment. You're right. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yes, cuddly and cute, and we're not talking about Simon. Where are you, by the way, Simon? <laughs> I thought you were saying something nice about me for no. a change. I'm at the British Wildlife Centre in Surrey, and look, look, this is just so delightful. Look, you would never normally see this. This is a little girl badger and her sister, and they were orphaned, and they're only about, we think, about six weeks old, David, don't we? We do, yes. They're about six weeks old. Their eyes are open. Um, they wouldn't normally be above ground at this time of the year. Uh, it'd be another two to three weeks before they were up above ground. What we think happened was their mother was killed on the road and a dog, a terrier type dog, went down into the set and brought these up. Had the mother been alive, there's no way would the uh, dog got anywhere near these badger cubs. So this is a rare old treat, isn't it? And uh, the other treat is that they are quite noisy, because I imagine badgers were silent. No, but these are very vocal. This is what they do underground to locate you know, their, their siblings it, and uh, also to where their parents are. That is uh, the noises they make amongst themselves. Now, you do have other badgers here. Will, will these eventually sort of move in with another family? We do. We have five other badgers here which are captive bred. Um, possibly they might, to see how they get on. More than likely, we have an, uh, a badger set, uh, a man-made one, in our nature reserve. Possibly they'll go down to that one with um, some orphan badger cubs which will be coming from Secret World in the autumn. Uh, and these two, they're so new, they haven't even got names yet. No, they haven't got names yet, no, but we will give them names. Although then comes the process of sending them back to the wild, which must be quite hard for you. It will be, it will be, but we hope that they would revert back to the wild state, but still retain a, an element of friendliness. Well, they are lovely, snuggly and warm, and great hand warmers on a chilly day. And let's see if we'll need them. Here's the forecast. Well, not a great forecast, but not the worst either. But uh, I'm thinking, Fred Sangers, if I pop this in my pocket, can we all look after this together? Yes, <laughs> of course we can. That was lovely. Thank you very much indeed, Simon. Safe journey home. Brilliant.